Hi everyone, I'm finally here. I made it. This 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 uh reading I was talking about, remember guys, I told you I was gonna call it the daily drama. <laughs> and the series, you know, I thought about it like even before December, like beginning of December. Not, like, you know, and like end of November. And I just keep I kept putting it off putting it off let's put the little dove here it's cute so i kept putting it off putting it off and then i was like today i was like i can't i have to do it you know and the spirit was like it's time they kept saying it's time it's time so like i told you guys if you've been watching my uh readings you know your zodiac this is gonna be about twin flame i said it there you go i said it this is a twin flame vibe reading it's the download, it's the energy I tapped into. Okay, so I'm curious to see what's gonna come out. Randomly, I picked out some decks and there are 11 decks. Synchronicities are crazy. Earlier, I was looking at the clock, it was 13, 13. Here, 13 hours, well, not here, everywhere. 13 hours, you know, even in the army, they're like, it's 21 hours, you know. 13 is one. It's like 13, 13 is essentially 1, 13 p.m., right? So 1, 1, 3. It's also 4, 4. Ascendant Masters. Okay. <laughs> there are two divine beings coming into union. Period. So I think I said it all. Let's just get into it. I hope you guys are doing okay. It's so gloomy here. I thought it was going to be dark. It's darker than it looks on the phone. I got to say, Samsung has the best camera ever. My, my iPhone broke since then I'm with Samsung. In the beginning, I felt so dumb because it was just like, uh, you know, I couldn't understand. It's, it, it does that. They're just so different, you know. But I do miss iPhone. I, will I get it again? Sure, I will. Definitely doing that. The thing is, like, if you have, you're so used to having Apple computer, iPad, all that thing, it sinks in, right? With Samsung, it doesn't. That's that's the, that's the thing, though. That's why I'm gonna probably have to get an iPhone because I have an iMac. So anyway, done. It's like, doesn't it look like I'm procrast I'm procrastinating? It's almost like I've been procrastinating this reading for a reason, a personal one. <laughs> well, I guess um, I don't have a choice now. I got to do it. Because uh, there's so much more. I think I'm already tapping into the second one. But let's start here uh, with the first one. So we're going to get an overall energy, of course. We're going to get the energy here with the romance angels, of course. It was a must. <laughs> Talking about twin flames and relationships. Also, I just want to say, you know, Twin Flames is, is not all rosy. So some of you, it could be that you are separated from your person because that's what it is, you know. Not that, okay, because that's a cliche. No, like runner chaser, the Twin Flame is going to leave you, come back. That's bullshit. What I want to say is that maybe there's a huge disagreement. It doesn't mean... Because it could be just a difference of point of view. Now, if it's stupid 3D shit, like, why did you look at him and blah, that's not your twin flame. You get me? Okay. Let's see. Did I cut the, the deck? I don't remember. Here we go. Here we go. Spirit, give us this daily drama dose. Daily drama. See that? This could be the one. Some of you have already met this person. Get one more card. Some of you, you feel this connection with this person. You don't know why. You can't explain it. It's visceral. It's 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 just when you look at them, you feel these things inside of you. Uh, yeah, it's the one. What does it say? You've already met your romantic partner. Yeah, the romantic partner you seek. Some of you, it's a friend, a relationship, you know, 
you, you, there's this feeling it's always been there from the minute you guys met but there's no action towards it and if that's the case they're feeling the same thing too let your friends help you this i almost felt that some of you this isn't a friend group i almost felt this some of you this could be actually one of your friends or the brother of your friend some stuff like that it's somebody you actually see you know like this is somebody you already know there you go this is somebody you already know guys the feelings are becoming undeniable now or spirit wants to tell you hello wake up what are you waiting for so you have asked for help ask for and accept support from others you guys are part of a group maybe express your feelings to some to, 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 to someone in the group someone you trust of course okay Bottom deck with reconciliation, like I said, some of you, yeah, like I was saying, this could be, you know, there's a little disaccord, disaccord uh, between you guys. Um, there's a, there's a, there's a, there's a reason, something. It could be an argument. I don't think so. I think it's circumstances that separated you guys. You know, physically, most likely. I don't think if it was like a, um. Like a separation where, oh, I don't want to see you anymore because we argued. I don't think that's it. I think it's a physical, like something that you know. It's like you're physically separated. You live in Germany and they live in freaking Qatar. Some, something like that, you know? So some of you, yeah, this is it. But for most of you, though, I'm going to say, you guys have not even, your friends. It's platonic. But this person is your soulmate. And you've been thinking this could be the one, but you're like, oh, no, 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 it's not possible. You know, that's not possible. Maybe they're in a relationship. Again, we're not going to go and cause a ruckus. But even if they are, because it's now, it's divine timing, 11, the 11 number, they're about to get out of union because it's time right now for you guys to get into union. I'm telling you. Get an energy oracle. So here with energy oracle here for my lovely, lovely crystals. I call you guys crystals. We're all crystals. We are the most powerful crystal. We are. We hold the crystalline cores. As I say that, look at that. That's crazy. It does not look like an explosion of... Look at her crown. Damn. Archangel Uriel. Freaking sacral chakra. Guys, the seventh chakra is the sacral... I mean, sorry. Crown chakra. The crown. Look at that. See, I told you guys, it's divine. This is a divine union. You know this could be the one. But you're like, no, this is crazy. You know, they know you could. They, and I want to tell you guys, whatever you're feeling, they're feeling it too. Now, I just got shivers when I said that. This is a 41, which is a five. It's now. This is the cycle. It like in the ethers. Divine timing. This is the time now where you guys are going to come together and begin this cycle as a whole. Because that's what Twin Flame is about. Two people making a whole. They're two halves, right? That complete each other. But they have to, do, they have to each go through their lessons and their awakening. Crown chakra. Needless to say... That's not, you guys, you know, you're, if you're coming together, you both have done the work on your side, on each other's side. So, and get ready for, listen, get ready for paradise, I just want to say. Get ready for paradise. These are your friends celebrating you guys. Right? Let your friends help you. I told you, some of you, if you, there's probably someone you can talk to. Why don't you? 
and you have the angel daughter spirit it's time that's that cycle the gate has opened um the, you know it's time i keep hearing it's time the time is now it's now the the, the spirit world um, the council they like the ethers god you guys it was written you know and 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 it, there was a a date you know there's no time up there we know but let's just say as a 3d person there was a date there was an alarm <laughs> the alarm rang it's like judgment kind of energy it, it's now okay so now let's get into mm -hmm, let's get into you guys as character like like let's talk about each of you okay we're gonna start with them this deck i haven't used in a while is the zilich tarot this is for them okay i'm using a deck for each of you guys so let's get a little bit deeper and get deeper into their character like like what are they going through now like how, what has what has been their journey till now without you okay because you guys are about to get into you and that's for sure but bear with me i'm going to repeat that a, a lot of times <laughs> because that is the subject of the reading that's the energy the alarm has rang you have the eight of pentacle prudence this person is very shy this person has been hurt in the past before this is eight of this this is eight of pentacles prudence you know some you know an eight of pentacles in the uh right away is somebody that excels at its craft that's very passionate so this person has been avoiding this by working maybe you guys work together they've been like pretending they're working they're busy when they cross you in the job they uh avoid you uh you do it too because remember you guys are mirroring each other but this is it this person is very um i i want to say this person feels this energy so strongly that um they they're scared they they they, they don't know it's unknown it's unfamiliar it's over the top it's unexplainable it's so divine that they're like there must be something no it just must be me you know it must be me this is a person that's very hard working for sure that is excel at his craft that is probably grab you know um that started from the bottom and that is like now here you know like it's they, they started as a clerk and now they're like uh maybe head of something you know or head of a whole department this is a very hard working person that has been working a lot that is very there might be a capricorn like earth sign very dedicated there's very trustworthy worthy somebody you can count on Somebody that puts all their energy in things and people they love. Somebody that's very dependable, I want to say. Somebody that is very, see, you got the devil. They've been working hard. Somebody that is very loyal. See, chariot. They're very, they have a successful career. That's what they've been working towards. I don't think uh, they're married or ever been. Um... I think they kind of tend to put their career first, but that's because they don't, <clears throat> they never, they're, they're someone that really believes that there's something that they deserve, like something, they believe in that love that's like, wow, you know? So why would they settle for lesser? I'm not saying they are virgin, they never had a relationship, no, they did. But they know, like, they're not somebody that's just going to, They if, when they propose, it's going to be to the one. Like, I hear them saying, if I get married, and it's it's just, it's going to be the right person. I'll only get married once. I hear it. They're very old-fashioned like that. Or very romantic, very, uh, they're very in touch with their yin energy. They're very, like, masculine because they, they work hard. You know, that very Capricornian energy, Aries energy. But also, they have this, like, feminine side to them. Look, the cancer card is here. Chariot. They do. They have this sensibil sensibility that they kind of tend to... They don't hide it, but they don't really show it. <clears throat> Again, remember, prudence. They're very protective of their energy. And they don't like putting themselves in situations where people could take advantage of them. So it's like, why for my all my business out there why be so like why show all my cards you see this is a very smart person look at this i told you two of cups they're looking <laughs> they're waiting for the right person i told you guys didn't i tell you 
They're waiting for the right person. Two of Cups, that is on their same wavelength as they are. It literally says love. Soulmates. This is not even just soulmate. It's friendship. I have your back. You have my back. I'm going to help you evolve. I'm going to help you grow. I'm going to lead. I'm going to hold your hand to success and vice versa. Do you see this, guys? Okay, let's get to you now. Let's get to your cards. So for you guys, I chose the... Um, hold on, let me rearrange because I have a lot of decks here. Like I told you guys, I have 11 decks. I chose for you guys the Spirit Song. Beautiful deck as well. Let's see what we have for you. We're going to get three cards as well here for you. A lot of decks coming here. So I want to make some space. Oops. Oh no. <clears throat> the Crown Chakra card fell. Okay, Spirit, what do you have for the other counterpart? And remember, guys, it could be vice versa, okay? And anyways, like I said, you guys are mirroring each other. So some of the stuff I say here, you might be like, wow. Some of the stuff I say here, you might be like, wow. Because guess why? Because you guys mirror each other. Two of Cups, you mirror each other. So, like, so like, don't freak out. Okay, or don't get confused. If you're like, okay, I am confused. Which one is, what, like, who am I? You know? You both are each other, literally, in a sense. Why did I hear just now? No more hesitation. No more procrastination. Dare. Okay. All right, Spirit. Get three more cards from, for whomever. <laughs> eight. Again, another eight. Eight of swords. Courage. Solutions. Feeling trapped. You know, the eight of swords is like your own mental prison. Like this, this little cute mouse is like on a tree. It's almost like, how do I get down? How do I get out of here? Is it a squirrel? No, it's a, it's a little mouse. See, you got two eights here. One is the eight of pentacles. One is the eight of swords. Meanwhile, this person is trying to do everything not to think about the connection, the energy, the feeling, the strength, the, the pool, the attraction, right? The other person is having a hard time, like, like get it out of their mind. It's, it's starting to, to overwhelm this person here, okay? So, yeah. <laughs> this person can't take it anymore. It's just like, they feel like they're against the wall. It's like, I can't deny this anymore. I mean, I need to do something about it, you know? What did I say? Judgment. Awakening. Here we go. Renewal, enlightenment, goes so well with the seven of, uh, sorry, this uh, seventh uh, chakra, right? I told you guys, this is the awakening. The time is now. Like I said, this person is like, I can't take it anymore. It's too much. You have judgment and the eight of swords. I need to get out of this. I need to get out of this feeling. I can't do, I have to do something. I need to let this out. I, I'm going to, I'm going to explode. I need to let it out. And you see, this is a um, a peacock. What does the peacock do? It shows up. It opens up. It shows its light. It just shows up. It confesses. It, 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 it's um, the peacock just is. It comes as it is. It, it, put, it shows themselves naked. Except they love it. <laughs> the peacock loves doing that. They only do it when people are around. The male peacock only. Other ones, it's like to shine. So somebody, this person here is coming out. They can't take it anymore. I'm telling you guys, this is imminent. This is happening, I mean, this December. Look at that. Ten of Pentacles. <laughs> oh my God. Stability, attainment, and 
you are not going to regret it. Let me just tell you. The minute this person here comes out, that's when the wheel starts. It creates this new cycle, the awakening, where you both are, you lock. It's, it's almost like it comes together. The yin and the yang just like, it's magical. It's, 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 um, it's, I don't even know how to explain it. It's out of this world. Okay. Ten of pentacles. What is that? It's family. It's community. It's stability. I feel like both of you are driven, right? This is how you complete each other. Both of you are driven. You, 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 some of you have, I'm telling you, you're doing the same job. You work together. Okay. So you are, you have this in common already that you're in the same field, you know? And it's like, every time you guys have a conversation, it's like, you know, this person, it just makes sense. Like they, they're answering questions you had the night before, you know, or something, something to do with your throat chakra. <clears throat> and <clears throat> also some, for some of you, when you get into union, you're going to have like very deep conversations, deep, deep get ready for some deep, deep conversations that are so transformative. Okay. And the 10 of pentacle pentacles is, it says stability attainment, it's status. Obviously when God puts two people that are meant to be together, like twin flames. So I, I'm going to say soulmates. Okay. Soulmates, you guys, you, you're provided for God provide because you're meant to do something here together. It's your mission first to come together and then do what you're here to do. Stability comes in. Everything, victory, everything is just going to start like, it's going to be as magical as you guys' um, relationship. You guys, once like this is set in, I'm seeing a, like a, like a machine. Once the machine is going and it comes from one person taking, making the first move and the other one going, oh my God, you know, you guys like, what is, why are we waiting? You're going to get married like that. You're going to uh, whatever you're going to, <clears throat> you're never going to leave each other ever again. Even if you don't get married, you're going to live together. You're, you're not going to leave each other anymore. You're moving in together ASAP. Oh yeah, it's on. You guys are on mission. God's mission. That's that, that, do you know? Do you, I, don't, I can't even describe that energy. I can't, because I, 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 I don't remember it. I know it, but I don't remember it. <laughs> Obviously, but I feel it and I, and I recognize it. I can't explain it. That's for you to find out, right? That's the secret. So now let's get an animal oracle and see how you guys are connected. Like, you know, beautiful cards. <coughs> Look at that. You got the two, excuse me. Somebody's about to come out and speak. I'm telling you. <laughs> you got the two um, majors one after the other so you have the chariot seven and then you have the awakening 20 which is a two the spiritual union seven is a spiritual number right seven chakra seven seven and then the two two of cups wow two two seven seven how crazy two eights you see how there's twos it's in a pair sorry excuse me community is a seven 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 that's my lucky number that's divinity right there. Seven, seven, seven. Then you have eight. That's the divine union, the, the, the Holy Spirit, body, mind, and spirit. Seven, seven, seven. Then you have, that's like that full circle. It's, it's guys, listen. Then you have two eights and then you have the two twos. Two, two, what is that? I just told you guys that I saw what? I saw 11. See, I mean, ugh, let me just shut up. Let me just, I, I'm overwhelmed. Let me get a card from here. This is a Divine Animal Oracle from Stacey DeMarco. Oh, boy. 
I just, I'm, I can't help having sh like shivers, continuous shivers. I know it's, it's freaking cold though. It is so cold here. I'm freezing. If you saw my, my tur I'm wearing this like turtleneck thing. Beautiful sweater from Zara. So you see between worlds, that's that judgment. That's the awakening. Going from black and white to that cornucopia. Remember bottom of the deck of the energy oracle? Where is it? Oh, well, here it is. Cornucopia. Your life is about to change drastically. Both of you guys' life. Because you're going into mission. This is a... You guys are about to go on a whole new level. You are... You ascended separately. They've ascended separately. And now... In, you Imagine both those fires. That ascension coming together. Awakening. What it, that's just, you guys are both awakening and then you're becoming this like whole powerful thing. It, it's like I'm seeing this yin and the yang, you know. Do you imagine the force of the yin and the yang? It's a symbol that is recognized and respected and everywhere, used in different forms, yin and yang. And it's also black and white. It's like two halves, you know, they come together. Dark and light, it's complementary, which it creates what? It creates the absolute number, zero, which is nothingness and which is everything at the same time. Oh, boy. I knew this reading was going to be something. Oh, let's get into the Kipper deck. Hold on, let me see what's in the bottom of here. Look at that. Stop it. Stop it. Spirit is all over this reading. Spirit is all over this reading. What number is that? Four. Which is what? Stability. Creating a safe space. Creating your home. Going home. You have finally arrived home. You, this is it. You are exactly where you saw yourself before you came here. What you, what you signed up for. It's here now. Why did you sign up for it? It was a long journey of suffering, of loneliness, to each his own. We all, we're not here to have fun and just like be kumbaya. Life is hard, okay? So we all have our trials and tribulations. We all have our pains, our sufferings, even things we've done. It's part of what we, 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 we wrote that. We, we, we chose this life, okay? I'm not talking about crazy stuff like, oh, you can't pay your rent, so you chose that. No, we're talking on a spiritual level, okay? I think you know that. So, everything you signed up for was to get here. You guys wanted a divine partner. You already know this person, but you forgot. But you know what? Do we totally forget? No. It's that feeling you feel that you can't explain. Otherwise, what sense does it make? It's like you don't remember humanly, but your souls remember each other. Oh my God. And then between, like the hyena, which is between worlds, it's 11. Okay. Oof, let's get into the uh, Kipper just to get a little bit more down. Let's come down to earth here because this is some like, I'm like, we're talking like some, we're up there. This is, this is not, this is an energy. I can't even describe it. I don't know. I don't know guys. So let's get a little bit, let's, let's come down a little bit because I'm flying right now. Let's come down with the Kipper deck and see some kind of situation whoop, between you two a little bit. What's up? What's up here, spirit? Four. The beautiful, beautiful people here that need to hear this message. Because if you're here, you need to. See, the toilet and the laboring, I told you guys. It's over. But again, a 38. Whoa. And this is why I went off about that. This gray. I was telling you, all this suffering, da 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 da. Now you've done it. That's what expanded you. That's what awakened you awakening that is what ascended you and them too some of you you're gonna find out some of you went through the same stuff and now cornucopia 
the sun, happiness, success, the chariot, money, abundance, stability, the ten of pentacles. You've been toiling and laboring. Some of you, I feel like one of them has a job and the, like one of you has a job, like a high status job. Like I, I said, this person here, that's very in, th that works, you know, it's very dedicated to their craft. They, they, they made it from here, from nothing. And I think uh, the other one doesn't, um, is not, someone is more high, like, uh, in the work department, like occupationally wise, you know, what you do for a job. One is more um, the boss than the other. So this could be your boss, right? One is a little bit more <clears throat> higher in rank, so money and everything. Some of you, you don't even have a job. One doesn't have a job, you know? One doesn't have a job. It's been looking for a job. It's been difficult, <clears throat> right? Don't worry. They're going to give you energy if that's the case. I just saw a flock of birds just fly by as I said that. I told you, they're going to hold your hand to victory. Didn't I say that with the chariot and the two of cups? Look at this. The gift. I heard the gift of energy. The the birds just keep flocking and, and, and they're like in third. They're like in tw tw 30. They keep flying over. This never happens, guys. This is the third one. Look at They keep doing it. It's, it's coming, okay? The gift, the gift of love. Look at them, the birds. It's giving me wedding vibes. It's like celebration. You don't know how spirit is celebrating you guys' union. It's crazy. And that's why the universe is going to gift you everything you need. Universe is so proud of you. This is a big day in the ethers. For your ancestors, the birds are, are crazy. I wish I could show you guys. This is a big day for your ancestors. Very, emo I'm feeling emotional. For the for your ancestors, the ascended masters. There's a big celebration happening there. Because they know that it's coming. There's a divine union coming together. Two people are going to be able to help the world. Two people are going to be able to be the, the, the channels of light and love and the word of the, the energy of God, which is love. See, two people are going to be here to bring the energy of love to these people in despair. That's what twin flames do. It's a five again, 32. You see that change up. There was another five here. Where is it? I remember there's something that was a five. Oh, well, here we go. You guys are going to awaken people. You're going to, you're going to spread the word of God, which is not to be too pre priestessy, priest, that's the church, the word of God, which is the word of love, hope, and faith. Believing. Two. Fives. You're going to awaken people. That's what twin flames do. Anyway, that's what they do. <sighs> oh, boy. Get ready for a new journey. It's over. The hyena. You're going, this journey here is filled. You're going on a journey towards this. Your cornucopia. It's your birthright, first of all. But you, it's almost like you wrote that you wanted it with somebody else. You guys agreed. And now you're like, it's almost like you guys said, okay, um, I don't want, I, you know, God, you know, I want it to go like this. I'm going to work. I want this test, this test. And we, we want to both do it on our side. And then for the experience, and then, you know what, we're, we're going to, we want our big bang. We want our big gift. Once we've completed our contract with you, God. Once we've done everything, awakening, and we've understood everything, we've learned everything, we, we, we did it. Then God, please, yes, then give us the Big Bang. Let the Big Bang happen when both of our energies come together. Two of Cups. Let our victory come when the two of us 
come together. Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Okay, here we go. Divine union. That's it. Two of cups, cornucopia. Divine union. does it's so such a relief right I feel relief I feel safety it's easy it's easy you know you know when you have like you know you have somebody next to you that you know that they have your back no matter what and conditional love you're invincible. Sure, you're, 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 you're invincible. That's what it is. <laughs> Let's get nosy and see, Let's see some, some information about their character. Let's see what sign they might be or something. Or their temper, tem temperament. Because here they have signs, they have houses, and stuff like that. Let's see. Let's get a couple from this astrological deck here. The Numinous Astro Deck. I love this deck. And see, get a little bit nosy about them. Again, because you guys mirror each other, it could be you too. Take it as it resonates. I'm sure you're gonna you're gonna find a little bit of something everywhere. You're gonna know who this person is immediately. If it's the person I'm talking about, there's more than five, mark my words, five messages, things I've said that you're like, that you saw him in your mind's eye, him, her. That's that intuition. Think slowly, rewatch the video, five, at least five, okay? If it's one, probably not. Five, guys, five. Five things that I said, and you saw this person clearly in your mind's eye. It's that person. All right. Balance. Two opposite meet. Balance comes in. What is balance? It's two. It's Libra. It's 11. It's marriage. It's helping the collective. It's duty. Two energy, give and take, equilibrium, respect, mutuality. It's the two energy, right? This could be also that thing I was saying. One of them work. One is a boss. You weren't. You were like, they're your boss, right? Or they work. You don't. See, let's read what it says. Actually. Relates, mirrors, yeah, told you about the mirroring, uh, manifests, objectives. Look at Jupiter blessing you guys with cornucopia. Jesus Lord. Oh, cornucopia is 11, guys. <laughs> Numbers for your reading here are 11, fives, uh, twos, eights, and sevens, okay? Jupiter, the lottery. What did I say about the 777 seven, seven, jackpot? The gift. Jupiter's expansion. Jupiter's in Aries. Like I told you, you guys are at your full awakening. That's why you guys are ready. Jupiter's in Aries right now. And you guys, guess what? Venus is on the galactic center, which is 26, 27 degrees of Sag. Makes sense, right? The twin flames would meet. Venus in the galactic center. Hello. Okay. Venus in the galactic center and Mars in Gemini. And, and Jupiter in Aries. Telepathy, I heard. Telepathy. So 
uh, Jupiter's expansion. It says enthusiasm, optimism, generosity, benevolence, mm -hmm, helping people in despair. That's what they do. Beliefs, so, I mean, sorry, luck, seeking, travel, positivity, lectures, foreign cultures, teaching, mm -hmm. pilgrimage, chance, expansion, leaping, exploration, potential. Jupiter's blessing you guys. And then what? Talking about benevolence. 11th house Aquarius. The edge. Friendship. You have friends here a lot too. Your friends, you guys' friends that you have in common or the office, they're going to be so happy. They're going to be like, I know it. They're going to root for you. They don't, they, they, they just like absolutely are going to be like, oh. They've, you guys have been like a soap opera. <laughs> They've been secretly talking about you. Let me just tell you. So anyway, group creativity, community. There you go. Hope. Humanity, tribe, festivals, discoveries, common goals, startups, rebellion, experimentation, the future. Lovely. So um, there's Aquarius energy, there's Sag energy, there's Venus energy, there's Mars energy. Okay. And then there's Leo energy, the lover. Expressive, creative, loving, playful. That's that warm energy, like I said. That childlike energy, it's innocence, it's purity, okay? It says, um, flirtatious, bedazzling, uh, vital, uh, um, juicy, <laughs> you know, self-confident, creative, loving, amazing, I'd say. Uh, let me add that one. Amazing. Let's keep going. These are the archetypes by Carolyn Miss, M-Y-S-S. Archetypes to see a little bit more about you guys' archetypes. It's yours, theirs, or the both of you. I don't know. Or pertaining to your mission. Because now, yeah, that's the word. You guys are about to get into mission now. You're going to be provided for by spirit. No time to waste. No time to worry about stupid, like, 3D stuff. You guys are like, if you have ascended, you are like on another a level. Both of your powers, imagine what it creates. Because you're powerful on your own, they're powerful on their own. Imagine those two come together. It's a force to be reckoned with. You're untouchable now. Untouchable. You guys are untouchable. You're protected. <laughs> That's what it is. Divine, the child, just got shivers again. What did I say about that childlike energy? Innocence and then divine. Child divine. It says it in the Leo, oh, no, no, sorry. It said it in the Leo card. Where is it? I'm getting excited. Oh my gosh. It said what? Playful, warm, loving, you know, trusting, expressive, child divine. You guys, your inner child's love each other already. They've always have. Your higher selves love each other. Your shadows even love each other. I mean, you love each other. It says innocence, purity, and redemption Spe suggest a special connection with the divine. Yes. Keep going. Amazing reading. I love this first um, daily drama. Not. I don't even know if I want to call it daily drama now. I'm just going to call it the, the daily. The weekly or something. Adventure. That's that Aquarius energy as well. The edge, you know. Going on adventure, it does say travel and all that stuff here. It says, um, inspires you to, to put compassion into action. That's what it is. You, It's like that um, humanitarian energy, right? So advent, uh, advocate, sorry. That's the adventure. Advocate. It's that humanitarian. Defending the poor. Defending the ones in despair. Standing up for them. Helping them. Ascend. Helping them have faith again in the divine. Awakening them. You see that? Advocate. That's what twin flames are, essentially. When they come together, they become advocates for causes, for the less fortunate, for the for the people that are abused and, and, and you know, that are victim of um, the darkness. Okay. Let's keep going. Now let's get into these spell cards. The magic of you. The magic of you, I heard. The magic of you. You. 
And when I say you, now get used to it. You're not going to be you anymore. When they say you guys, it's not going to be, okay, let's say your name is Michelle and his name is Kurt or Kareem. They're not going to say Kareem. Oh, Kareem did this. Uh, Michelle did. Oh, Michelle. I saw Michelle. Yeah, Michelle. No, it's not going to never again. It's Kareem and Michelle now. It's a one. People are not going to be able to dissociate you guys' name anymore. I told you. You're one now. Kareem and Michelle. Some of you might even take each other's name. Usually it's the man, right? I mean, the masculine, right? We, the, the feminine takes the masculine's name. I'm pretty sure you guys are going to both take, your, take each other's name. Or maybe not to that extreme. But your children are going to have both you guys' uh, last name. That's for sure. Because they need to know who they are. There is definitely some sex. How could it not? I don't even think you guys do tantra. I don't even think you. It's not as banal as like penis and thing. Let me not be vulgar. My nose is itching, so this is like definitely a reading for someone. This is like a touch, a glance, a hug. It, it, it everything is sexual, sensual, not sexual. You guys, you telepathy. I said that before. Okay. <laughs> Your freedom flowing from far away. I dance, I love, I laugh, I play. That's totally the freaking energy. Guys, my nose is itching, so this is definitely a confirmation. This reading is from some is for someone. I'm telling you. And then you have healing. You guys are supposed to heal people. We know that. Let's not go over it again. It says, Candle flame, burn this hour. Bring me to bring to me your healing power. You guys are advocates for healing people that are in pain, in despair, to sum it up, in darkness. Some of you, it's to do with your touch as well. You bring laughter, love, and joy to people. You guys are going to do seminars. Some of you, you're into dancing, music, food, I'm seeing. You're definitely going to be having a lot of get-togethers uh, uh, at home. But because this, you're in mission now, you're going you're gonna to always be in the public eye. You know, you're like gurus now. You're going to always have people around you. And it's always going to be this energy where... That's what you are. Laughter, joy, reassurance, and belief, and just faith and love. But love, the love, the godly love. So every time people are around you, it's going to be laughter, play, dance. My heart chakra just went, oh, expanded. Look at this. This is a green card. It's advocate. Both of them are green. Advocate and healing. The heart chakra. I love this reading. I love this reading. Ooh la la. Oh my goodness. I'm sorry, spirit. I didn't read. I didn't do this before. This is this is this is somebody's reading. I hope you find it. And I'm glad you're here that you have found it. And believe me when I tell you, I'm not playing. Okay. This is happening. And you have no idea. You have no idea the level of this. I can't even express it in human words. So I hope you feel the energy. Because the energy is here. It's in the reading. It's around. It's in my heart. It's it's all over. I'm in it. That's how I'm able to read it. That's why it came to me. You know? Get a sacred destiny, sacred union, sacred destiny. Two cards. Adventure, see, advocate. I said adventures before. See, <laughs> look at the beautiful waterfall. Amazing. Yeah, there's travel. There's meeting people. Communities forming. 
left and right. It's amazing. Illumination uh, shivers. This reading is all about shivers. I can't. The awakening card, illumination, third, like a uh, seventh chakra. It's time. With this card, I'm here. It's time. It's imminent. It's it's imminent. See, this is almost like before dawn, before the sun comes out, right? I told you this person can take it anymore. Where 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 was that? With the um, eight of swords and the awakening, they can't. They're coming out. They're making the first move. They can't. They, they no longer can live like this. It's becoming uh, painful. <laughs> I'm hearing, I can't do this anymore. It's becoming too much. I, I have to, I, I can't. Okay, where, okay, am I losing my shoot here? My shit, basically. Where are the making magic cards? I just had them in my hand. What? They magically disappeared. What the hell? Guys, that's weird. I had the magic, making magic cards right here in my hand just a minute ago. They literally just disappeared from the table. What is going on, spirit? Spirit's playing tricks. No, 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 attends, hold on. No, seriously. Oh my God, look, they were here because there's another card. I almost like lost it. Okay, what is this, the, 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 the second card? Wisdom. Well, won't you look at that? Wisdom and illumination. And what did I say? Adventures in the bottom. This is it. You guys, you're sharing your wisdom and your knowledge. Okay? And it, you're, you're awakening people with, with your wisdom around the world. Around you, for sure. But it goes beyond that. Like I said, you're creating communities together. Okay? Jeez. Okay, so. You're creating communities together. Okay, ma making magic now. Let's just keep tapping into this magical energy. It was magical even before I started. I can't stop it. I can't, like, like, like I cannot. I'm having shivers and my nose is, like, killing me. So this is definitely a message for someone. And I'm so happy and so honored, Spirit, that you, you, you chose me to be the channel, the delivery person. That, that trans, you know, that, that translates this, that, that, that brings this beautiful message. Whomever's watching now, thank you for using me as a channel. Thank you, Spirit. Thank you, Guardian Angel, Ancestors, God Almighty, Source. Triple Moon. Embracing all aspects of yourself, the divine, oh my God, and the earthly. Wow. Shivers again. Are you surprised? The divine. And the earthly, like embracing, remembering your divinity, remembering, finally, you're going to remember. You're going to remember, you're going to remember clearly just the vastness of your soul and of your being. How, it's like, I don't know. And that's why you guys come into union. Now you have access to that because you're supposed to pour that into other people. Okay. Triple moon. I love this. I want to get this tattoo. I know it's cliche. I always love this symbol. You know, it's the moon. Uh, wane. Uh, uh, new moon, full moon, and waning. Okay. On target. Your ideal life path, what is that? It's your mission. Follow your ideal life path. That's it. This is the life path you chose. This is what you were supposed to do. Some of you are life path five. Some of you are life... Oh, see all those numbers? That's what it is. Some of you are life path one. 
11, 8, 7, or 5. Okay, or 10. <clears throat> I think 10 breaks down to a 1, though. You don't keep the 10. 11, yeah, you keep the 11. Because it's a master number. 10 is not. So, no. So, 1, 11, 8, 7, 5 as master numbers, okay? What am I doing? Prosperity, cornucopia, just for the protection. I saw that because here you have it. Security, where is it? I was gonna say that, security, and then here you have protection. You're definitely protected, <laughs> how could you, you, you guys, yeah, you're in mission now, you're untouchable. Strong protective magic for the family and the home, you're, you're untouchable. Uh, a prosperous business with riches and success. Like, and I want to say, you know, it doesn't matter, adventures, it doesn't matter if you, you don't have a job, because it doesn't matter, because you both are going to create the, the, the mission. Whatever they're doing, they're not going to stay there anymore. You guys are going to be each other's, like, you guys own a boss, because you're setting up this thing that is bigger than you. You are God's earth angels right now. Period. Okay, period. Everything you wished for, you thought you couldn't have, you can. All right, I'm done. That's, this was intense, beautiful, charged with God energy, charged with the ethers, the angel, the ancestors. Thank you, God. Thank you, angel, ancestors, God Almighty, source. Ooh, ancestors, God Almighty, source, angels, ascendant masters. Thank you so much. We thank you. We are so grateful. Always. Thank you, Spirit. Thank you. Thank you. So grateful. So grateful. So grateful. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you, guys. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Um, yes. Congratulations. You did it. <laughs>